happening now. Cars being lifted into the sky in Dallas, soon to be in with reach of their owners. After four months, the vehicles were stuck inside the parking garage due to a crane collapse. They're now on their way out. Our Jennifer Lindgren is live at the Elon City Lights Complex, where all the activity is taking place. Jen, it's kind of quite the sight to see. Yeah, that's right, Russ. We've seen eight of those cars come off of the roof, be lowered down to the ground level by a crane right now. They just finished doing one vehicle, so you're not seeing any action at this second. But the work started around 8 this morning. Once down on the ground, they are loaded onto a tow truck, and it's another step toward reuniting residents at this damaged apartment building with property that they haven't seen in months. The building was declared unsafe after that deadly crane collapse that also damaged the site of the complex back on June 9th. The tenants forced to leave a lot behind, including their cars, their trucks, their SUVs. Starting this morning, crews are working from the top floor and then proceeding down to the ground level, photographing the vehicles and using a crane to lift them out of the garage, lower to the ground, where they are then transported to what apartment complex officials are calling a secure storage facility. There, the owners can claim them. We expect this to be a slow process, maybe just 10 to 12 vehicles taken down today. In a Facebook post, the Elon City Lights team also says it is finalizing plans and a schedule for residents who are looking to reclaim property and belongings that they still have left inside of this building. Live in Dallas, Jennifer Lindgren, CBS 11 News.